After first session with 36ers, what next for Kai Soto? So we will see. Ano bang ba susunod na hakbang ni Kai Soto? So ito dahil ito sa post uh, interview niya after the New Zealand breaker finish. Filipino teenager Kai Soto was non-committal when asked about the, his future after including his first season with the Adelaide 36ers on Sunday. Soto contributed 12 points in the 36ers' 93-60 demolitions of the New Zealand Breakers, ending their 2021-2022 campaign in the National Basketball League NBL on a winning note despite missing the playoffs. He ended the season with respectable numbers of 7.32 points, 4.36 rebounds, and 0.68 block per game while shooting 51% from the field so to average 15.2 minutes per game making 23 appearances for Adelaide the season just ended so to said when asked so we we will see here that talagang he ended about his status for coming season i need more time to think about that i sabi ni guys the 19-year-old can declare for the 2022 NBA rookie draft, although he can also opt to stay with Adelaide Soto, sign a two-year contract with the 36ers back in April 2021 with an option for a third year. So far, Soto is not included in the list of players who have declared for the NBA rookie draft. That deadline for early entry is today that's april 24 previously if he knew of soto's plan adelaide coach cg bruton gave no hints of it however he confirmed that he has already has had discussed with soto's father and agent we already had a chat said bruton who previously said that he expects to see soto in the nba pretty soon he spoke to his dad agent guy it's about him getting better and he's doing that and he's working every day so talagang uh, napakaganda ng kanyang pinakita we look forward to what's ahead for him in the future the coach added so 23 games from Adelaide and he finished the, the games with flying colors, even though it's limited time. While he's not yet disclosing his plan, Soto guaranteed that the work continues for him. For me, work doesn't stop. I'll still continue training and developing. Whatever comes after that, we'll see, he said. I don't see myself being a complete player right now, so I have to continue on developing, getting better skills, and especially getting stronger, getting faster. He also said, there are a lot of things I need to work on and this offseason will be a good time for me to get better. The 2022 NBA Rookie Drop will be held on June 23 at the Barclays Center in Brooklyn. So that's uh, the news update so far from Kai Soto. So, abangan natin ng mga susunod na kabanata. Sa ngayon, nasa Pilipinas si Kaisoto at nagpapalakas.